I know the wrath of Abby's crazy, I want to be Kathy's all boy team behavior is going to come down on that one moment. And there's nothing I can do about it. And I feel helpless. Now my kid's going to get screamed at. They're all yeah, going to get screamed no, at. She'll pick on Chloe especially. I can't stand it. I can't stand that I have to sit here and wait for this woman to come in here and berate us. Good job! Just so you know, Abby's going to come in here. It's going to be awful. Nice job, Chloe! Huh? Nice Let's job. Let's go. We're leaving. You want Chloe gone? We're gone. You get your way. You can have whoever Walks you... Out, falls all over the place with the turns. No, she didn't. And then drops her hat. Yes, she did! No, she didn't. You yes, know what? Did. You go ahead and replace me. I'm leaving. I'm not going to make a scene with oh, you. Oh, that's the easy way out, No, right? I'm done. I'm done. This is not what I signed up for. Humiliation for my daughter. I didn't humiliate her. Yes, she you did. humiliated herself Abby, she fell out of shut the up. Turn. Shut up. Stop talking now. Replace us. That's fine. Come on, Chloe. We're done. Get away from me! I thought besides somebody dropping their hat, it was not bad. I think that more is going on in Christy's head than just Abby yelling at Chloe for her losing her hat. I mean, there's been a lot going on this competition season, and I just think that we're all a little stressed right now. Get away from me. Get away from me. See you, Christy. I mean, what are you thinking? Am I going to reprimand Chloe? Am I going to tell her what she did wrong? You bet. You're sure you want to go back in there? I can't leave my teammates. Abby's not going to make this easy. So when we go in there, I'm going to talk to her. And you just kind of go in the den and stretch and get ready. I mean, I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know. I mean, I'm assuming you won't be on pyramid. My job as your mom is to protect you. And at that point, you didn't deserve that. Like, it was hard that night when we were laying in bed and we were talking. And it was hard to think that that was going to be your last dance, because I like to watch you dance. I think that we just needed time. And I think we needed to put some space between us and Abby, because you love to dance. And I don't want anybody to take that away from you. But more importantly, you're a great kid. And I don't want anybody to tell you any differently, because your hat fell off on stage. Yeah, I want to go back in there and dance. I just hope that I don't know what Ms. Abby's going to say. If you need anything, I, I'm there. I'm not going to let her say anything or do anything. I know this is where you want to be. I know, I know. Let's get in here and do this thing. <sighs> I want to walk into that studio like I want a stiletto jammed in my eyeball. But we're back because Chloe wants to dance, and I don't do this for myself. I do it for my daughter. Hello. Hi. May I speak with you? In private. That woman thinks that I'm going to give her the time of day. How dare her even walk into this studio? All right. We've had a member of the team suspended. You all know what suspended is. It's like the last chance before dismissal. We will be attending Intensity Dance in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Everybody will be in the group dance. The name of the routine is Money is the Root of All Evil. Moms, the costumes are emerald green, like the color of money. And they're going to need some work. We need headpieces. We need trim. And you'll be using actual real money on the costumes. I don't know about this idea about putting real money on these costumes. We spend enough money on costumes as it is. This is going to be an expensive week. Money is the root of all evil is the name of our routine this week. Now, the routine is contemporary, but it has a little bit of flamboyancy to it. And we're going to use real money all over the costumes. Now, ladies, think about this. It's bluesy. So think of being in a speakeasy. Of course, our kids do not go to speakeasies, besides the fact that they are underage, and they wouldn't go to a bar. And there is no such thing as a speakeasy. Years ago. Yeah, it doesn't exist. You, girl in the front, move over to the right. You shouldn't be center. Boom. Abby won't refer to Chloe by her name. She keeps calling her that girl or her or she. I mean, like, how how belittling can you get to not even say someone's name? I want to teach Chloe, you can't take anything for granted. Because even if you're gone, the show must go on. So, Chloe, if you want me to remember your name, then you need to prove it to me. Make me remember. 
She just says, girl, she doesn't even say my name. And she's being really mean to her. During rehearsal, Miss Abby really isn't acknowledging me and like saying my name, and that kind of really hurts my feelings because I'm still a person. She's just doing that to hurt you. Don't give her that satisfaction, Chloe. Don't give her the power to upset you. You're my daughter. Like, come on, you got a little bit of me in you. Fuck up. The group is not where I want it to be. I know it's been a long day, but this number is nowhere near competition ready. Lock the back knee in the lunge. Oh, somebody's foot was flexed. Yo, Blondie, you were gone for a week, not a year. If Abby doesn't come around and at least give Chloe the common respect of calling her by her given name, you know, I can't say that I'm gonna sit back and just let it happen. My daughter has a name. Not anymore in my book, Oh, sweetheart. yes, she does. She has a name, Abby. So do you. Yeah. It starts with a B. Give me a dollar stuck right behind this green glitter. Do you have any money in your purse, Kelly? I'm not so sure this is a good use of money, but Abby wants lots of dollar bills to put on the children's costumes. All right, coming to the stage next in the junior small group division, this is entry number 23, entitled Money is the Root of All Evil. Woo! routine was very innovative. I thought it was something different than we had seen all day at the competition. And that's going to help us score high. And the last but not least, ladies and gentlemen, your highest scoring elite junior small group. Act number 23. Money is the good volume. Enemy in the studio, one, two, three. Happy Lee Day Company! Congratulations, Woo! dancers. Let's do a bow on three. One, two, three. Ladies, sometimes, Reed is good. Yeah. Woo!